Is the end of gas powered motorcycles in the near future? Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. You know, guys, I saw recently in the news that uh, Britain proposes on banning petrol cars and vans in 2040. So that got me to thinking that in the future, motorcycles will probably be on that ban list as well. And of course, everything, all the shit starts over in the UK with those those laws, you know, emissions laws and all that shit. And it eventually comes over on this side of the pond over the United States. And it gets implemented over here years later. But that got me to thinking, can you live with just an electric motorcycle? Say motorcycles, uh, gas powered motorcycles get banned in the future. And I'm thinking, you know, I already did a video on electric motorcycles, you know, my thoughts on them. Um, that I feel like, at least right now, the technology is not there to please me, at least. I love the sound of gas powered motorcycles, man. <laughs> I don't like the sound of air now for dual sporting I can see getting one I know zero has a dual sport as uh, electric dual sport but I'll tell you guys that I mean for doing some urban fuckery like I do uh, it'd be perfect stay quiet people can't hear you get in and out in and out quickly have your fun like I'm doing get my little quick in And, uh, which is all good, you know. The only thing that sucks is that if you, you can't go too far, you gotta be real careful on the juice. Because, uh, if you don't wanna be stranded out, out in the woods. Woo! Good time. Urban fuckery. Love that shit. But you know what I think they should do though, man, is um they need to put at least do a hybrid. There's nobody talking about hybrid motorcycles. I just did a video talking about it, but nobody else seems to even give a shit about that. I think hybrid motorcycles is is more is better for motorcycle riders. You know for distance because we don't have to worry about being stranded you know I figure you know at least put a gas generator on there that's what I say do at least put a gas generator so if you do run out of juice that you could just pull over turn the gas generator on by the boom by the bang about a, what 40 minutes or so you're back up ready to roll it wouldn't take no big deal wouldn't take that much emissions it would cut down on emissions obviously and uh holy shit the fuck is he doing out here man doing some shady shit out here but uh damn look at <laughs> No officer, I wasn't during, doing any urban fuckery. Oh, what's this? Oh, I just, uh, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> Fuck. I gotta get rid of the evidence, man, when I do the urban fuckery. But, I don't know, guys. I just, I feel like for the price of electric motorcycles, they're like expensive, man. For what you get. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, maybe we get to the point, like I said in other videos, where you could swap out batteries at gas stations or something like that. They, they should make a universal battery for all electric motorcycles. Not different ones, but universal. And have all gas stations carry them and keep them charged up. And we can swap them out. And that would, that would be sick. You know, I could see that. But I think, like I said, even better yet, put a gas generator on there. 
keep a little gas in there you know if you get stranded turn it on by the boom by the bang you're charged up within 45 you know in less than an hour and uh so i want to hear your thoughts guys what do you think would you be really really pissed off obviously i would be if they banned gas motorcycles and you had to only your only option is an electric motorcycle i got i feel sorry for the future generation man because it is getting shittier and shittier out here i mean in this world with these emissions restrictions man fans but the uk they got so they add more laws like every year i mean i feel sorry for you guys out there you guys are just freaking just the government just got a, a noose around you guys is next man <laughs> i'm glad i don't live out there i love the united states man i'm very grateful to live out here except for this slow ass car in front of me is messing up my twisty action man we got to mix it up over here you know what i'm saying <laughs> It's just it's too boring following that car, man. Frick. And I want to be an asshole and pass him. It's a, it's a double yellow here. It's against the law to pass him. So all I can do is just do my little fuckery off the side of the road until we get to a point where I can lose this guy. Hey guys, if you want to see more of my videos, go to my website at cyclecruiser.com. Click on the menu tab, my videos. All my videos are categorized into various playlists. And hopefully you can find something that will inform you or entertain you. Hey, hit thumbs up if you like this video. Share this video with your friends. And uh, this, and subscribe to my all-in-one motorcycle channel. But anyways, that's all I have for you. So I'll catch you guys later. Deuces. Hey, don't forget to check out my other YouTube channel that features the original Bug Out Moto van that is designed and built by yours truly so that I can live in my van with my motorcycle. So hey, check me out at youtube.com forward slash bugoutmoto. Subscribe today.